with finals experience. That hasn't happened since the 1991 Chicago Bulls. They lose only 15 games in the regular season. They lose only five games in the playoffs. And now they have the championship trophy in their hands. Sports Center. Currently on ESPN, John Anderson, John Butcher Gross with full post-game analysis live from Cleveland. So much more as the NBA season comes to an end. Let's just listen moments ago to Steve Kerr and his comments. Why are we did this? We did it at the beginning. So That's fun. That was incredible. Incredible work. I told you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Ten more and we'll get you. <laughs> so the champagne is flowing in the visitor's locker room here at Quicken Loans Arena. Meanwhile, at the other end, obviously disappointment for the Cleveland Cavaliers. I love you. I'm back. Home brought unbridled joy to the city. The kid from Akron was back home and hopes that he could end the championship drought. He came all so close, taking the team on its back and put on a performance for the ages as they came with the two wins of winning a championship. But the fairy tale ending was not to be for LeBron James and the Cavs, at least not this season. Warriors won a championship in 75, led by Hall of Famer Rick Barry and coach Al Adels. They swept the Washington Bullets, but it was 40 years before they got another title. The Warriors, until the last few years, were irrelevant for most of the past two decades. First time in 40 years, the Warriors team has been here in, in about six years since I've been here just to see where we came from to, to now and all that's gone into that. It's, it's a special moment. What a magical year. The best team from start to finish. 67 wins. The coach said their commitment to each other made them special. The league's best offense, the league's best defense, an entertaining style led by the rookie head coach who's had such a fascinating basketball life, five-time champion player, front office exec, TV analyst, now a championship head coach. The MVP, a brilliant point guard with breathtaking skills, shined on the game's biggest stage, not physically imposing, but he strikes fear into his opponents. Clay Thompson, the other splash brother, what a year. They talked of training him last summer, but he answered the talk with an all-star, all-NBA season, and now a ring. Andre Iguodala waited 11 years to win it all. His acceptance of a bench role set the tone of sacrifice for the season. His starting role helped turn the finals around. So many others contributed. The emotional heart and soul, Draymond Green, that's that stuffing energy. He'll earn a hefty contract this summer. So one of the great seasons in the history of the NBA ends with a title. A long-awaited title for the Bay Area. Here tonight in Cleveland, we say the Golden State Warriors are the 2015 NBA champions.